well so what's going on everyone this is David with another video one of today's video I've got for you guys another payday 2 weapon review so uh, yeah before we're gonna get to the weapon review itself um, I finally got my new mic um, I re really really enjoying this mic really such a great microphone I'm glad I bought it and really wow just wow and I'm basically using it right now for this commentary. So tell me uh, what do you guys think in the comment section below. Uh, that would be greatly appreciated. So yeah, now for the uh, weapon review itself. Um, today we're going to review the AK-762 rifle. Now the clip size of this weapon is 30. The total ammo is 90. This is a fully automatic 762 rifle. Now, this is by far the only gun that actually shoots this kind of round. So, this is kind of unique. This is kind of unique. Um, most of the rifles uh, basically shoot the, um, the 5.56. So, this is basically the, on the main difference between this and the other rifles. Uh, and yeah, now for the damage. Um, well, the damage is pretty good. You can down someone with one shot. Um, so yeah, I guess it's pretty good. Uh, the accuracy, uh, well, it could be worse. But yeah, for now, this is really, this is more than enough. This is just wow. You can really, uh, you can shoot uh, if you have a better sight. I'm gonna get to the sights um, about this weapon. There's such an annoying... Um, well, I won't call it feature, but this is like a really annoying thing that uh, if you're trying to use a sight on the AKs and the M308, um, this the sight itself is going to sit farther back, and this really annoys me because this is really hard to see. Um, well, you can see it, but this is really annoying comparing if like uh, compared to the AMR or the UAR or whatever. Um, this is really annoying. This is why I don't really tend to use the AKs anymore. So yeah, this whole sight kind of thing. I'm really, this really annoys me. But yeah, I think, well this I guess how the, how you basically uh, perform I guess in real life too. So I th I'm pretty sure the sight is going to sit farther back even in real life. So there should be some sort of realism in the game. So I, I kind of get it. it. It's cool but I don't like it. And now for the visibility and mobility. Uh, it's pretty standard, nothing too crazy. Uh, noise is pretty loud. Um, and the recoil, well, um, it could be worse, really. It could be worse. Uh, but yeah. Now for the loadout. Um, I was I was using here the AK762 um, with a custom Ford grip, stock, and a barrel extension, and of course the sight. I just can't remember the names really. Um, and for the secondary, I was using the um, uh, yeah the Bronco 44. Um, really, just a great pistol. And uh, yeah, now for the um, yeah, I guess my uh, opinion. Should you get this weapon? Short answer: Yes. Long answer: um, It's complicated, really. If you want something that uh, can do a bit more damage than your average uh, rifle, so yeah, sure, go with it. But if you uh, really like, I don't like the the fact that the side itself sits so far. Well, it sits like farther back than um, than your average assault rifle. Um, so yeah, sure, just leave it. You can buy it and use it, you can try it if you like it, so yeah, sure, go with it. But I'm not going to use this gun ever again. Um, so yeah, um, this is overall a pretty nice uh, rifle, pretty unique. Um, but uh, yeah, overall that's it for this uh, weapon review. Please leave a like, comment, as much appreciated, and if there's any uh, rifle, secondary, everything, uh, you want to see the next episode, uh, please leave it in the comment section below. And uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed.